What's up, Mana family, and welcome to day two of this week's Morning Mana. This week, we're looking at the story of Peter walking on water, and we're looking at a few things that Peter did to grow in his faith, a faith that led him to walk on water. And while we don't build our faith to walk on water per se, we do build our faith to know God in a deeper and more personal way, to be able to confidently walk out all that he has for us. Yesterday, we looked at Peter, how Peter asked uh, with boldness of Jesus when he saw him coming on the water to command him to come out to him, to walk on the water out to him. I shared that if we're going to walk into all that God has for us, we need to ask boldly of God. Today, we're gonna look at the first half of Matthew chapter 14, verse 29 that says, come, he said, meaning Jesus, and then climbing out of the boat. Let's stop right there. There's so much to unpack in just these few words. See, Peter was bold in asking, but here he is actually putting his money where his mouth is. He's talk, He's taking a step out in faith. And I want you to imagine this. Peter knows that there is no way he can possess any amount of skill or talent to walk out to Jesus on the water. He simply sees Jesus doing, and a, doing it and asks to do it as well. Then he steps out trusting that God has him. I love the picture of that. This is the perfect picture of faith for us. And here's the big th thing I want you to notice. While Peter asked boldly first, that the other disciples could have asked also. The other disciples who were in the boat could have climbed out of the boat too, but they didn't. They chose to stay in the boat where it was safe. I want you to ask yourselves, is that really the safest place? Walking into all that God has for, for you requires boldly asking and bold steps to follow. Let's pick up the story again tomorrow, right here. I'll see you tomorrow.